Hi, I'm Robbie. I'm going to show you how to play Picture on the Dashboard by Brantley Gilbert, the second version. The little bit faster version. Now, before I go anywhere, I want to give a shout out to Dustin Owens. He's been following me for a little while now. And we've been working on Facebook for a couple hours now on how to get this intro down. So I finally just came up with an easy way to teach you guys. Uh, it's not the correct way, but it's close enough to where you can pass it by. And as Dustin says, it'll be good enough to get you laid if you're a plant to a drunk chick. Actually, this works for a sober chick, too. But uh, if you're just playing for fun, it works. So what we need, now he plays it, uh, Brantley plays it with the, with the capo right here. But the way I'm going to teach it, it uh, sounds better without it. That's your call. Trickiest thing about this would be the strumming and then the chord changes, which is basically a regular song. But uh, anyway, start off. You need your C add nine. You need a G. You need a D. You need an E minor seven. That's it. Oh, and that D is a D slash F sharp. So mute that. Strum the whole thing. Sleeping. Also, Dustin's the one who gave me the pencil and paper capo idea. Just to let you know. Okay, so we got. We want to hammer on with a C add 9, it's a C add 9, a G, and it's a D, but watch. I'll play through. So we got hammer on. So G. Now lift it up, make a regular D chord, lift up your second finger, put it back down. Okay, so that's your intro. Now your verse, it goes C add 9 to G split, C add 9 to G split, E, seven, e minor 7 to D split, so C add 9. Back to E minor 7. So the 
this the strumming doesn't change even I just got a little shaky there. So we'll go. And then the chorus it picks up and uh, it gets a little easier. And it's the same progression as the verse, so we got still got your pain. Changing up the strum and I'm going So I'm just adding a lot extra down up on the first, I mean on the second, on the G. And um, we'll play it through one more time. We'll play it through slow. All I have to do is the bridge and it's C a done in D so you got strumming part is the hardest part of this song and it might be a little confusing the way I've been switching it up I've been, uh, just try to follow what I first said and uh, then you can feel free to switch it up after that now I'll try to look up the other version of the song and because I'm used to this version I'll try to put it up if I can and if I get requests for it uh, Dustin thanks for the help and uh, I might redo this lesson if I do, I'll post the link. But in the meantime, here you go. Don't forget to subscribe. Any questions, points, comments, or requests, put below. And we'll see you next time.